Welcome to video number two of my social media series about social media for beginners. Today we're going to be talking why be on social media. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below so you don't miss any videos in this series or any other videos that could help your message get seen in a cluttered newsfeed. <music> businesses when they start out get on social media because they think that they're just gonna post things and get millions of dollars in sales and that's really not how it works it's important to remember that social media is a really complex creature but also pretty simple as long as you're doing it consistently being on social media is gonna help your business so much because it's really gonna give your brand so many wonderful benefits including brand loyalty and recognition the more present you are and the more available you are to people that could potentially be your customers or your existing customers, the better off you're going to be because you're going to be able to build that relationship with them. And of course, by building relationships, you're going to be able to create loyalty and recognition in your industry. Another thing is you're going to have more opportunities to convert potential business into actual business. This is going to be accomplished because you're going to have a place to share links, information about your business, what you have going on, sales, promotions, blogs, landing pages. There are so many things that you can be sharing and posting on your social media that are going to help you convert people that may be on the fence or just learning about your business into that final sale. And by being present on a regular basis, you're going to allow for them to have the opportunity to remember you when the time comes. Or maybe you just happen to say that one perfect thing that gets them to hit that buy button. Social media is actually going to help you a lot with your other marketing efforts. I have a checklist for you guys to grab in the description below that seven things that you want to make sure that you have set up before diving into social media marketing to help you with having a more successful social media strategy. By having those things in place, you're going to be able to convert better and get more inbound marketing from your social media. That's going to happen because you're going to want to share the things that you are producing in that seven things checklist that are going to be used in social media. Honestly, though, the best thing that you could ever possibly do with your social media is build relationships with your customers. And while that might sound a little hoaxy and idealistic, that is really the whole purpose of social media. And that is to build relationships and connections with people through what you're posting. And bonus, by becoming friends or building that relationship with your customers, you're going to be able to learn more about your customer. There is so much data and information available on the back end of Facebook and Twitter and Instagram and all the other social platforms are gonna help you market better to your customers. And by building that strong relationship with them, it's going to allow for you to give them more of what they need and tailor the things that you might think you wanna offer or that you are offering to them better. So that's why you wanna be on social media. It's gonna help you with your inbound marketing, it's gonna help you with relationships, and it's gonna help you with brand recognition and of course, loyalty. Make sure you tune in for our next video number three where we are going to go over what you should be posting on social media. Again, make sure you grab that checklist in the description below with seven things that you should do before you start using social media. Until next time, I'll see you soon.